Hey y'all, it's Carl, Carl and Dawn's Homestead, I am back. The other day, last Friday, I received a Facebook messenger uh, from somebody I'm not even friends with on Facebook, out of Golden Meadow, Louisiana. Uh, and the message said that um, they looked me up through Facebook, or looked up my last name through Facebook after finding out that uh, a duck decoy carved, hand carved by Don Contrantius and signed by Don Contrantius was being auctioned off at the South Louisiana Wildfowl Carver's Annual Auction in Homa, Louisiana. So the message continued to tell me that uh, they looked over the list of uh, That was the auction list and found this on there and wanted you to let me know in case I was related. So I, I uh, messaged them back and told them, yeah, I am. That's my late brother. Passed away a couple of years back. Don was a, just like my father, Don was a carver. He was a woodsman. He was an outdoorsman and a craftsman. He did a lot of things. My father also was a carsman, woodsman, outdoorsman. He passed away four years ago. Oh, I'm sorry, five years ago now. And um, I have brothers that do it. I'm a carver as well. I'm not as much as a professional as my dad, my brothers, and my uncles were. But I am uh, Nevertheless, carver. I do carve, hand carve decoys. Maybe one day I'll do a video on that and on some of my work. Um, I know all this is not related to the homestead per se, but this is my journey, my life, and uh, this is a hobby of mine. Anyway, I knew I had to go to that auction the next day, that Saturday, and get or at least attempt to buy the um, decoy that belonged to my brother. I have two pieces that he carved over the years. This is very old. Uh, Don was 61 when he passed two years ago. And, um, well, anyway, I went to the auction that Saturday. My wife Dawn and I went and we bidded and I knew it really didn't matter to me how much I had to bid I just knew I had to bring it home sentimental reasons my brother you know I mean this is he's no longer here so I went and I have my decoy y'all and it's signed by Don I remember this decoy very well back in the late 90s. He lived in Lafitte, Louisiana, which is a little fishing community. And I built the house next door to him. And I lived next to him for a few years until I decided to sell. Anyway, we sat down and we carved a lot of decoys. And I remember this, but this, was, this wasn't this was carved then. This was carved before that. Um, but I remember the duck. Anyway, I have my duck. I have my brother's work. And it's in my house now. While I was there, I took the uh, opportunity to bid on a couple other items and ended up with this one. A little green wing teal, signed, hand carved by Mr. Arthur Pellegrin. I bid it on it and I won it. So he's a local carver. I'm not sure. I know he's out of uh, that part of the country or that part of the state. I'm just not sure where. But Mr. Pellegrin uh, carved that and I have that. But I just wanted to show you guys. This is what I have. Also, right behind here, I'm going to take a couple of pictures. I think I have a couple of pictures of the auction itself. I'm going to put behind this video. 
and uh, let you guys see. I think I have a copy. No, I know I have a copy of the uh, the uh, brochure for the auction. I'm also going to put it behind here. I just wanted to show you guys. I went to this auction, got a piece of history from my brother. This was carved many, many years back. I remember it. I went and I bought it. You guys have a blessed day. And subscribe to my channel. Comment and like. We love hearing from you. Thanks for watching, y'all. Have a good one. Hi, right, guys. South Louisiana Wildfowl Carvers 2017 Decoy Auction. See various decoys by various uh, carvers. And, uh, of course, I don't know how much you can see this. This is the one I went after right here. That decoy, Mallard Hen by Don Contrantius, my brother. And, uh, happy to say I brought it home. And here's another one coming up. The 41st Annual 2017 State Wood Carving Championship Competition, which is going to be held June 2nd, 3rd, and 4th, 2017 at the La Rose Civic Center, La Rose, Louisiana. And that's going to be a pretty good event. And I'm hoping that I can make that event. All right, don't go away. Let me show you the decoy. And of course, as all of you know, this is the decoy I went after by my brother Don a long, long time ago. It is signed by his, his name, Don C. I remember this decoy like it was yesterday, but it was a long time ago that he carved it. And like I said, early, uh, late 1990s, probably 1998 through 2003. 98, I built a house next door to him in Lafitte, Louisiana and uh, lived next door to him and we did a lot of carving together hanging out together and stuff like that and uh, this, this decoy was before that but I have uh, two more decoys that were in my possession at least that Don did his cypress tree dugouts 12 foot long uh, his daughter has one and I don't know where the others went, but I know he has uh, did a lot of dugout. And actually, I have a newspaper clipping where my other brother Al and Don, Don entered that P-Rogue, which was paddled by my other brother Al, in the Lafitte P-Rogue race many years ago. I have a newspaper clipping. I'm sorry I didn't think about it, but I could have brought it out and showed you guys. And uh, anyway... I, maybe I can do that later when we do more decoy stuff. Just wanted to show you. Thanks for watching my uh, videos, guys. Leave a comment and subscribe. And uh, like. Thank you.